morning. Ben from B&H Motorsport. It's a fine morning. We have the uh, Borg Warner Turbo on the L200. Uh, don't know if I can pan around, but uh, there she is. Um, just have a look. Uh, please excuse the streamer noises. People are up early on a Sunday. It's a nice sunny day in the Falklands. So my wife and I'll be able to use this. But there she is. Um, fresh from last night. We're just uh, giving a check over this morning. There's my dodgy oil filter. <laughs> no, it's, it's not leaked. So, um, yeah. I need a re relocation kit. And I'm going to pop her right here. And some more lines. Uh, on the nice view bank lamp. Down through and uh, nicely tightened up um, yeah don't know what the actuator's adjustment is yet well, I ain't done any logs so uh, yeah everything's in a well. nice position just enough space you see how close it is to the oil filter um, yeah very close uh, you know looking at Five to ten mil at the most. Um, yeah, uh, just see, come back. We've removed the uh, DigiB3, and that was the exchange for the turbo. That's where it used to be. That was the map sensor. Uh, here was the uh, remove the screw, and that was the. Uh, a vacuum controller, a pair bird one. Um, yeah, I had a few issues with the, the filter. As you say, you can't get it in there without removing the filter, and I needed it downturned so on the uh, turbo outlet. As you see, um, we'll do a start up. Um, I got a uh, it uh, obviously take the management lights off the dash because it's um, I've had the airflow meter off so and first start up see what it does. Oh there we go. That's a better sounding turbo. Cheers. Yes. Yeah, that's the better sounding turbo. Check for leaks. Well, it should be leaking here, but it's not, not really. The sound of that. That's not a diesel sound, is it? Give it a little blast. like to subscribe if you like the videos I make uh, it's a journey uh, with the L200 so yeah so we're get, gonna get a, a three inch front mount fitted uh, 600 mil by about I think it's about 425 something like that um, yeah it's gonna be an eBay special so nothing expensive uh, I'm gonna open the front out um, happy with exhaust for now uh, eventually I will get on that downpipe and make a three inch back to my custom back box. Um, you know, I'm happy with exhaust, it's just uh, matte finish and out turned and out the side. So it's, uh, yeah, good. Hopefully the wife likes it. As I say, we're gonna, we're probably gonna drop the boost. Um, yeah, this, this turbo's uh, pressure ratio is because it's off an industrial engine, it'll run less boost bottom. Uh, yeah, 
uh, just a few maps to compensate. Um, yeah, I'm gonna. Re it runs standard around 20 psi uh, with a, but I can get the pressure ratio up of around 2.4. Well, that's around 2.4, so that's its limit really. Uh, I may squeeze a few more psi out of it, you know, because it's second hand and, you know, it, it may give it some more, it may not, but um, it's going to be talky, it's very talky. At the minute, I took it out last night and, um, yeah, it was, it was alright, uh, 2,000 revs, it was a bit, a bit laggy to 2,000, but uh, 2,500 revs. The turbo time just increased, and uh, yeah, it spooled, it spooled and pulled and pulled and pulled, and yeah, we were soon in Mexico, so um, yeah, uh, it's a lot better, a lot better. But you just gotta deal with the lag, and you know, and I'll tune, I'll try and tune that out uh, a little bit, what I can. Hopefully we'll get a, a good drive later on. Yeah, please enjoy. Settle down nicely now. One more rev. One more rev.